All right, homies, I'm basically gonna walk you through an entire workout. Uh, this is gonna be a base builder workout, which is just a program I wrote for myself coming back post-cancer, not having trained for like really five months at all. Um, this is just a all-around program to work on flexibility or range of motion, um, strength, endurance, the whole lot. And it's basically full body multiple times a week. Every other day, I'm basically going full body uh, for a while just to hit everything and get everything conditioned back up and just progressively overload into a good range. So I'm gonna show you it doesn't actually take that long to get a good workout, full body. So you're just gonna go on this ride with me. And remember, it wouldn't even take you as long because you don't have to film and I'm filming myself. So let's get it. Start this workout and we are going to do some just walking as a general warm up. Boop, start, boom. So when you're working out, a lot of the times you need to warm up before the workout. And you'll see people have these complicated warm up routines, but most of the time, I think the best way to warm up for anything is doing the thing you're doing or going to do at a regression. So my best example for this would be jumping. The best warm up for jumping is jumping, but do 10% jumps, then 20% jumps, then 30% jumps. So in this workout, I'm gonna do push-ups, I'm gonna do rows, I'm gonna do squats, and I'm gonna warm up for those things at the beginning by doing regressed versions of those things. And this would scale to anything. If you wanna do a one rep max squat, do a bunch of squats with the bar, then go a little heavier, and once you start getting into that higher range, you know, you're working. So unless you have a specific reason, you're doing some super hyper mobility routine right before you do something, just warm up, do a regressed version of what you're doing, it gives you more practice and it'll warm up the exact things you need to do what you're about to work out. I'm obviously making IG content as I do this too, so. I'm just gonna go here for like two minutes at this pace. I'll speed it up a little bit again. I'm just trying to get my blood flowing and just get generally warm, get my heart rate up to get ready to do other movements. And then like I was talking about, I'll do some of those specific movements, but just regressed versions of them to get the specific muscles and joints warmed up and then I'll just go. And truthfully, as you get more in shape, you don't have to warm up in the same way as intensely as I am now. I'm using these warm ups as just more volume at a very low intensity since I haven't been training as much. Oh, and for anyone wondering, because my, my Instagram account got deleted, uh, so I made a new one. So welcome to the new Connor Barth IG. And you can find my other channels, you know, Connor Barth TT for TikTok, Connor Barth X for Twitter, or X, and Connor Barth YT for YouTube, so. Hello. Yeah. Perfect timing. Wee bloop. Uh, uh, here we go. Oh, oh. <laughs> no, it's okay. Are you sure? Yeah, it's fine. Everything's fine. It's beautiful, actually. Be in any of it, because I'm planning on like. I mean, I'm. I'm yeah. So. Um, maybe you're, saying, I have you're not a whale. Don't, don't disparage yourself. <laughs> and don't we all feel like it sometimes? You can see what I'm about to do. You can see I'm just doing body weight versions just to get the movement, the feel, get like the full range of motion, feel my quads, feel my glutes, feel my core, be tight. And then I'm doing the same thing with RDL just to get that nice feel. Now I'll actually do weight and I'll do my first round. You'll, you'll again be like, Connor, you're doing such light weight. I know, I'm progressing up every workout. It's better to progress at a smooth, steady pace on something that's easy 
up into the hard range than to just go ham when you haven't been training for a long time. That's when a lot of injuries occurs, when you spike the difficulty back up quickly, especially with, again, no training at all. So nice, smooth, safe progressions back to healthy and back to the activities I was doing before, like dunking, basketball, etc. One. Two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. One, two, three, four, five. Six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Yep. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Mm. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. It's so important to track what you do too. You don't even have to do it in an app, but if you do it in something like a notebook, Whenever you get hurt, the best thing you can do is look back and see what changed. And like, sometimes it won't be your workout. It might be like your sleep or your diet or something like that. But depending on the level you're trying to get to, it becomes more and more important to track the data. Like Olympic athletes are tracking, well they aren't, but their coaches are tracking a lot of data to make sure that they're recovered and that they're actually progressing forward over time. For general population though, you need to track very just fundamental things. Like, did you work out? Did you eat right? That, like, did you sleep? If you do those things, you're, you're most likely gonna be good. You also see, because I know I'm doing super light, my rest is gonna be much less because the biggest thing that I'm lacking is, like, I'm still strong. My endurance is just shit because I've been not training for, like I said, like, you know, four or five months. So I'm going a bit faster so I can get more cardio in too instead of just giving myself a bunch of rest because strength-wise this doesn't bother me but it does start to burn just because of the endurance aspect. Three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Good. Last set of RDL. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. All right. So now I'm about to move to push-ups, and you're gonna see me do the same idea. Like, I'm just gonna do some knee push-ups with full depth, just to get nice and like warmed up for my actual set. Push-ups, like full body weight push-ups for 10 reps is still pretty hard for me. So uh, I'm not gonna do that many, and I'm gonna do the same thing with rows. I'll just do a slightly regressed row to warm up for my rows. All right. <clears throat> 
Let my shoulders stretch. Oh. This just takes the weight of my legs out of the equation. Makes it a little easier. And like my arms already feel warmed up there, so I'm not gonna do more. And I'll just do some light angle, really just focusing on pulling with my back and getting the proper motion in while keeping my core tight. And that feels good too, so we'll just go into the next actual round. Again, tracking it in the app. Yeah, yeah. Don't think about it while going in. Also, don't think about it while in. No, <laughs> just think about something else. I just, need just take the plunge, literally. Good. <sighs> yep. And then just focus on the breathing. And then just stand out here for a minute before you go into the sauna, just to like, yeah. That was good though. Like, actually your reaction was quite chill compared to other people. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, Dude, my biceps are so weak. We, we have the gym purely for our own satisfaction. Definitely not because we want to help people. Yeah, the only, the only reason to own a gym is so you can use the gym instead of getting an LA Fitness membership. Let me go into super debt to just not pay an LA Fitness membership. Oh, all right, let's see if I can get 10 reps more. Focus. I lost count. Eight, nine, ten. Well, extra set. <laughs> if I didn't. No. No. Yeah, what's up? I don't know if I'm far enough, but for those that don't know, Ben hates it when there's no music in the gym. So let's see how many seconds it takes for him to be annoyed while we are in our rest. What do you think, Zach? I say less than a minute. Okay, I say like 10 seconds. One, two, three, four, holy fuck. Five. Six, seven, eight, nine. Bad form. And holy. Two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. Ten. God, makes my biceps hurt. Mark off all these. <clears throat> Thank you. One, two, three, four, five, six, oh, seven. Oh. <clears throat> Nine. Oh. All right, that last one didn't count. Yeah. <laughs> Eight. Oh. Oh. And just put my hands across. Good, full, full flex at the bottom. 
and then boom, all the way up to neutral. You can even go past, it's not that big a deal. Seven, eight, nine, ten. I really focus on my back too. I'm not like trying to use my hamstrings and glutes quite as much because I'm already doing those in the RDL. Oh. And I'm just doing bent knee gar hammer raises and just squeeze up, slow down, squeeze up, slow down. I'm just trying to touch my face basically. Just like that. By then. This guy's always got a suit on. I feel stupid. That was all on camera, so you gotta bleep that out. It's too, too, not woke enough. There you go. Special. One. Day's leg day if you're a beast. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen, fourteen, fifteen. Woo! One, two, three. Four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen, fourteen, fifteen. 12, 13, 14, 15, good. Just to round out and do them because I can for a superset so I get some rest. Two, three, Good. Two more rounds. Still be more comfortable now. One. Oh yeah, it's much better. Five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven. What's funny? Oh. Oh. One. Two. Three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, and eleven, twelve, thirteen, thirteen, 
But truthfully, doing, doing this full body workout has taken so little time. It's probably like 55 minutes in and I've spent half of that being distracted by people. I'm just gonna rep these out real fast. I'll show you something you don't have. Or I'll show you something you don't. That's what I meant, yeah. Oh. Because I have a pump from doing all this workout. That's like 800 views right there. I'm going to get like 10 followers by the end of the day. Three. I've already got nine. Yeah, you're in the, this is just the whole raw workout. <laughs> Since Soleil abandoned me, I'm just using the fucking Soleil. Went out of town, so now I don't have my filmer. So I just have to use the trusty box. Yeah. 100%. With captions, since people might not be able to hear you because I'm getting mic'd up. Yeah. See, yeah, it's not a joke. That's why it's like, I can actually be like, yeah, I had cancer, I have one nut. Like, it is what it is. Yeah. Hashtag rip fitness. <laughs> I had testicular cancer. What? I had testicular cancer. So I had to get a nut removed. It is what it is. But I'm fine now, so it's whatever. That was like that was like five months ago. Yeah. You never would have known, right? Exactly. My one nut is worth other people's too. So testosterone levels out the roof. <laughs> I think that was a fantastic first video.